Jenny and left a fight on the biggest fight of our lifetime, made with the fact that to be on that card. Man, it's unbelievable. Why? It's unbelievable because, I mean, you know, we, we I wasn't... I was a young boy, you know, wasn't even around. You got the Tyson Holyfields and, you know, you got the Muhammad Ali, George Foreman, and now you have Mayweather Pacquiao. You know what I'm saying? This is crazy, the elite stuff, man. So that makes me step my game 1,000%, you know what I mean? And that's what I needed. I needed to, to go out and revamp and, and go back to, to, to the OJ Leon that I need to be the, the one that had people hype about me, not the one that's having close decisions or whatever the case. So, you know, I need, just needed to step my game up, and that's what I'm doing now. Does that mean you don't need to buy a ticket? I'm definitely not buying a ticket. No, <laughs> not at all. I don't care how much money I make. Six grand, I'll go spend that on something else, not a ticket. <laughs> Jay, how, did, how does it feel for Floyd to kind of, you know, I mean, kind of singled you out. I mean, he's, he gives you a lot of attention, a lot of advice, kind of took you under his wing a bit. I mean, how does that make you feel as, as a fighter and a person? I mean, it's a blessing, man. You know, that, that's that's the, one of my best friends. You know what I'm saying? Um, me and Floyd, you know, I mean, you know, like I said, man, you know, I met a lot of people on this road to being, to, to want to be a champion. And you know, that's one person I met, man, that, you know, just a genuine person, a genuine individual. And I got his back 100%. He got mine. So, you know, that's what it is. When you first came to the gym, did you ever envision you would be like this, be his friend, be nah. in the position you're in now? Nah, you know, I just was coming to, you know, make, you know, make, make the stage for myself and then eventually stand on the stage and do what I got to do. And you know, you know, God puts you in different positions, man. And, and you know, this is the position He put me in. Were you a fan of Floyd growing up? I mean, recent years, not as a kid. Yeah, right? of Why? course. What I was mean, it about him? first off, from Michigan, Grand Rapids. I'm from Detroit. You know, well, Inkster, Michigan, but you know, the bigger city, Detroit. Um, I mean, he was. I used to like Zab. I mean, still do. <laughs> Those are the two guys that I like. You know, Zab used to have the grill in his mouth. I used to, I used to think that was fly. <laughs> like, you do had the grill in his mouth, he was fly. Did you ever you know get one? Nah. I mean, Why I got, not? You I do got, it now. I got nice teeth, man. I ain't doing that lot, man. You know what I'm saying? So, and what was it about Floyd? And just how he was, man. The you know, money, he yeah. can fight. You know, I come from... I'm, I, this is every place, but where I'm from is, you know, I've always seen the flash. My, my dad was a street guy, and my brother was a street guy. You know what I'm saying? I was in the streets, so flashy was it. Big wise of money, the jewelry, you know what I mean? The yeah. nice cars, the furs, whatever the cake, the gators. You know, only a few people know about the gators, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so the gators, stuff like that, man, that was it. You know what I mean? So that's something I've always, you know, attracted myself to. That's what I wanted, you know what I'm saying? But now I know that it goes beyond that, you know what I'm saying? You know, so... Uh, you know, that, that, that's why I liked him. And then the dude can fight. You know, he talks shit and he, and he backs it up. See, people don't give him enough credit, man. Cause, I mean, I remember once he said, you know, people don't forget I'm a fighter. Like, I can fight. Do people forget that? Man, you know what, man? It really don't matter what people think. I mean, you know, people are spending crazy crazy amount of money to come see this man fight. Whether win or lose, they're going to pay. So You get to see him in the gym fight every day almost. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> But at the end of the day, it really don't matter what, what critic, what anybody says, right? I mean, they're going to tune in May 2nd, regardless of what they think about him, to see him fight or, or win or lose, whatever. How do you see that fight playing out against Pacquiao? I, mean, I think, well, I think Floyd going to fuck around and stop the shit out of him, bro. Like, nasty. I'm not saying that because that's my dude, you know, my homie, you know what I'm saying? But real shit, like, I just watched him spar. All right, yo, we got to think, we, we was six months off. We was all around, you know, flying and everything. You know what I'm saying? So, um, it's just the first week. Is there a different hunger for this fight? Than I see it. Camps? I see it. I think so. I definitely see it. I mean, yo, you, I don't know. You know, you guys been to camps to interview Floyd. Is, everybody be there at 3 o'clock. Floyd is show up at 6. Floyd is there at 3 o'clock. No, no doubt. You know what I'm saying? He just on time with everything. He's on. Yeah, I can just see it in his face. And, and I think he's just going to demolish his group. Are you absorbing this, that you're part of this camp and part of this fight, or are you going to wait till years from now to soak, soak it all in? No, I can't wait till years from now, you know. Tomorrow's never promised, so I got to soak it in now, you know what I mean? And, and what's it like for you to be in a private jet, growing, like, you grew up very rough, yeah. and now you're living the life of very few? It's a blessing, that's all I can say, you know what I mean? It's a blessing, and, and, and I'm happy to be in the position I'm in. Message to your fans if they're watching? Thank you. I love you. The ones that hate me, the 
ones that don't, I love you all. You know what I'm saying? I wish I could hug you all and duck the slaps that you were trying to give me, but whatever. You know, no, it's all love, man. You know, I appreciate the, the support that you give me. You know, um, hope nothing but, but for me to put on good fights, you know what I mean? And do better than what I've done so far. Man, thank you, man. Good luck. Good luck. I appreciate you.